Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. Today I'm going to share with you a few little clips that I took earlier. One of them is actually showing something new that YouTube is doing on our comment section. And I took a little video of that so you could see what I was talking about. I also am showing you um, I went outside and I'm showing you where I was getting the eggs out of out from under Silver Fox how we have to do that because otherwise I would get bit by her beak or snapped or something their beaks are hard as hard as hard can be and it can break your skin really easy and it hurts when they hit you um, I also went to the bank today but I'm not going to show you that I um, went out and came right back home. The um, traffic has been quieter, but the kids went to school today, so there was um, a lot of that kind of traffic. Probably parents going to work and things. Um, I think there was three. Oh, I think I show you the different color of the egg because. I get one egg and it really looks blue compared to another egg that looks kind of green. So I'm going to show you that. I believe that's one of the videos. I believe. So let's go to the video and I can, you can see whatever it is I showed you. Today there's something new that's on the computer too. Not only are we getting these little dots, now we're getting little statements that you can click on like in the emails where you can just click on it and if you want to stop there you could stop there or you can add to your comment I add to the comment that's nice that they put those there but I add to it and as you can see there's Karina and there's Tina look at that you guys rhyme Karina and Tina hello oh look at they think I'm coming with treats not yet girls I'm gonna get my eggs first and then one will do the you got the hat, got the hat. okay Here you hold you can hold this well I and you gotta hold the door up too because I'll do the hat <laughs> here's your hat this is how we have to get our eggs out from under Silver Fox because she will snap at me. Let me see if I got anything under there. Oh yeah, there's a white one. What else do we have? And another one. A green one? Okay. And that's it. Okay. Good girl. Thank you. I oh, got one over here too. Oh, I'm gonna put these in my pocket. Hold on. Ooh, this one's cold. Those were nice and warm. Let's see if there's any under here. Oh, there's a blue one over here. Or a green one, whatever color you want to call it. They're pretty. Woo! There goes a feather. <laughs> okay. That's probably it for today. Here, you want to lock that other door? Okay. <laughs> That is more blue because this one is more green. This one's more blue. Mm, yep. It does look different. It does. And this one is one I got today. And this one's one I got today. This one's warm, this one's warm, and this one's warm. So that one must have just been laid. That mm -hmm. was but this one must have been earlier. Yep. Mm. Buddy running just because he went in. Because you're in there. Well, they'll all follow me now. Come on. Let's go. Oh, I'll be here. Come on. Okay. Hi, Emma. Here, chick, 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 chick. Here, chick, 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 chick. Come on. Here, chick, 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 chick. There you go. There you go, pretty boy. Let's get a little bit in the house. Was the bulb burnt? 
Yeah, and I gotta get a brush to paint. Oh. Well, we'll add this in here. There you go. Oh, it's cold out here. My goodness, is it cold. Well, that's the videos that I've, I'm sharing with you today. I don't know if I show you when I'm feeding the chickens or not, because I didn't, I don't remember what I showed. I don't remember. I don't remember what you had in there I don't know either. I may have when I was giving him some chicken scratch. I'm not sure. Um, Jim had to change the light bulb in, and actually the light fixture, because it had totally rotted away. It's been out there for a couple of years, three years yeah. maybe. And it actually rotted away, so he had to fix it. And he said, well, maybe we won't need it. But in the next few days, it's supposed to start to get cold again. So we're going to have temperatures that are going to be below 32. So I don't want my water to freeze. So he had to fix it. So that he did. But I didn't I didn't take a picture of that. I didn't follow him. And, and the birds, did they fly out or did they no, stay in there well, with you? The old, the, the new ones didn't stick around but the uh the buffs they were all right around yeah, trying the buffs to see are what I was friendly. doing. The buffs are real friendly. It's those darn bantams that are not friendly. And the, the they're the birds that I got from my daughter because when Emma wanted to go broody, I didn't have a rooster at the time, so I went to her house and I gathered some eggs and I took the ones that I was hoping were hens. Because they did say, I watched a video that was talking about the shape of the egg can determine the sex. Well, it's really, I don't know. I have never done it. I would have to get a bunch of eggs and test it out for myself. But they say the rounder the egg, the more chance it's, it would be a hen. And the longer the egg, the more chance it would be a rooster. But I don't know because I've never done it. I don't know if any of you have ever done the egg test where you take a bunch of eggs and if you take note which one how many are round and how many are long as to whether you've um, incubated these eggs and you find out whether you've gotten hens or roosters it would be interesting to know if any of you have done that so my question today is have you ever checked to see if you gotten if you could tell whether it was going to be a hen or a rooster by the shape of the egg I guess is how I want to put it I don't know yeah. you you probably got the gist of it I hope and if not oh well well we'll talk to you tomorrow bye